from inside towards Terrell. Clever through ball, McGuinness! In it goes, 3-2. And maybe, just maybe, there is time. A first goal at home in the league for Josh McGuinness, and how important could it be? Hull City have got two minutes. Two minutes is all they have, but is it enough time to complete an incredible turnaround and bring themselves level? Leo De Silva going in search of Elder, taking advantage of the space left behind by Cash Terrell. Hull City lead! A fantastic moment and really all this hard work Hull City have produced in this first half has paid dividends and the side nearer the wrong end of the championship table are giving a side rich in form at home a real scare at, in their own backyard. Matty Cash, secondary position, pushed well forward there to go and meet the ball. A lot of space in behind. Leo De Silva had the ball at feet into Eldo. It was a delightful cross. It's one of those crosses where you just have to whack it away if you're a defender. Otherwise, someone in a blue shirt for Hull City is going to get a toe on it. And the Tigers lead here by one goal to nil. Hard work has paid off and Nottingham Forest are going to have to do it the hard way. Jarrah Bowen off penalty duties. Same scenario as last year. Penalty for Hull City against Preston and it is McGuinness and he slams it in that is the start Hull City were looking for Rudd couldn't keep it out and Josh McGuinness makes it 2-0 whatever Alex Neal said at half time has not been adhered to and the former Bolton Wanderers man makes it 2-0 and he just went for the old school penalty hit it hard hit it low made up his mind, eyes on the ball and Rudd have scored in Hull City shirts but Josh McGuinness has the opportunity to get his first goal for the club and he slams that in no hesitation on where he wanted to put that into the bottom right hand corner and that brings new life to this Carabao Cup tie Hull City back in the game, not many chances created to be truthful But he hit that hard, made sure it was going to make the net ripple. And Josh McGuinness not even facing the Preston crowd here. As he steps up and he slams it in again. No nonsense penalty once more.